The Earthquake Ready Burnside Bridge project considered two ways to manage traffic during construction, to fully close the bridge or build a temporary bridge. Construction is scheduled to start in 2024 and last four to five years. In order to save money, reduce the construction timeline and impacts to natural resources, the recommended option is to fully close the Burnside Bridge and detour traffic to neighboring bridges. The other option is to build a temporary bridge to maintain some level of traffic at Burnside over the river. However, it would only hold about half the vehicle capacity of the current bridge. It would add an extra 1.5 to 2 years to the construction duration and cost an additional $90 million, while only offering minor travel time savings compared with the full closure option. In addition to the time and cost savings, a full bridge closure is recommended because it would use less building materials and reduce greenhouse gas emissions and impacts to natural resources. It would also allow the Burnside Skate Park to remain intact and usable after construction. The temporary bridge option would require partial demolition of the skate park. Do you agree with recommending a full bridge closure during construction? We want to hear from you. Learn more and let us know your thoughts at www.burnsidebridge.org.